Let's go over the Redline lug nut locks. So this is gonna come in handy if you've come out to your trailer and it's on cinder blocks and your wheels are gone. So what this is gonna do is it's going to give you a very unique little lug nut, which can only be loosened with this special little key that comes with it. So it's gonna be very, very difficult for somebody to get this thing off and steal your stuff. Because as of right now, it's just a 13, 16 socket. Everybody's got that in their house or their shed or their toolbox. So this is gonna be a little bit easier to do so. So let's show you how it works. Pretty much, we're just gonna put one on each side. So we just need to find the lug nut. It doesn't matter which one you do, we just need to put it on one of the studs. And this is gonna be for your half inch lug nuts, which is a very standard size for your trailers. So you really don't have to worry about it not fitting. It's pretty much every trailer we see here has that size lug nut. So we're gonna take one off and then we're gonna have two of these. So one is gonna go on this side and then one is gonna go on the other wheel on the other side of the trailer. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna just thread it on just like a normal lug nut. You can do it by hand like this until it gets all the way snugged up. And this is where the key comes into play because a normal socket isn't gonna do anything. It's just gonna rotate around. And the cool thing about this key is it looks like it's symmetrical, but it actually isn't. So there's only one way that it's gonna go on there, right there. So it's very, very unique. It's gonna be very hard for someone to either have this or make one. So once we do that, we can tighten it all up. I like to tighten it all kind of by hand here. And ideally we have this kind of elevated and lifted up whenever we're torquing these down. So I just like to do it by hand and then come back here through with a torque wrench and torque it to spec. And after that, you're done. You can use two different sockets. I'm using a 13 16 because it matches the lug nuts on my trailer, but you can also use a three quarter inch socket. As of right now, our wheels and everything are taken care of, but the trailer can still be hooked up to and stolen. So I recommend grabbing a wheel lock like this. This is gonna prevent it from rolling, so someone's not going to go and take your trailer out. There's one other thing to really protect the trailer to the ultimate degree, and that's just gonna be preventing them from hooking up to the coupler. There's a lot of different ways you can do it. It just depends on what kind of coupler you have. So if you're in the locking mindset, might as well search our website. We have a lot of different things to give you peace of mind just to protect your stuff. Very simple product by Redline. Do I use them on my trailers? Of course, why not? It's a very simple product to just give you peace of mind. And that's pretty much it for a look at the Chrome lug nut locks by Redline.